Hi there YouTube, Emperor George here. Welcome to my YouTube channel. Uh, this is the first episode in a five part series in which I'm going to show you how to build some basic Minecraft houses. These are built using really easily obtainable resources like wood or sand. So they're absolutely perfect and just right for building on survival mode. They look great as houses for villagers or as part of a self-built town like this one. So this is a town square that I've been working on for quite a while, I'm not going to lie. Uh, all of it's been built on survival. Uh, by episode 5 of this series, we're going to be building houses similar to this one. But to start with, we've got to learn the basics. So this is the most basic house design. Uh, as you can see, it's pretty simple. Um, so it's 7x7. Seven seven. The framework's actually 5x5, five five, but when you put the roof on, it becomes 7x7. Seven seven. So to start with, you're just going to need your oak blocks or whatever lock you've chosen. And you just pop them down there. And you count three and pop another one down. Same again this side. One, two, three. Pop one down. One, two, three. And pop another one down. Now each of these then needs to go up by three. Oops. There we go. And then if you just fill all of these in, that then forms the framework and base for the house. There we go. So now it's time to fill it in. So depending on which side you want to put the door, leave a gap for it. And just fill this in with the planks or whatever you've chosen there. Same again for this side, but I'm just going to leave one gap for a window rather than two gaps for a door. I'm not going to put a window on the back, although personal preference, if you want to put one there, that's fine. But I will put another one on this side. Again, up to you. Now it's time for the floor. Unfortunately, I don't have a shovel, so you just have to bear with me a second. Minecraft 101, always take a shovel. Not me. And then I'm gonna use the slabs and I'm just gonna fill in the floor. Now the thing with slabs, they obviously only take up half a block. So you need to point them at the top half of the block where you want to put them. So there's the frame of the house. It's time to start working on the roof. So switch to your stairs. You just want to lay these pointing at the bottom half of the block you're looking at. Just like so. And then just one overhang on the edge. They can be quite tricky, I suppose, but you've just got to aim for that corner there. Fill these across. Nice and simple, nothing too complicated. And then hopefully you bought a stack of dirt with you to get on the roof. There we go. So same again here. Just lay them all out. Pop that one right on that corner and again here and then you just want to put another bit another three out logs there and one in the middle and this forms the top of the roof oh Fill these across. Don't forget about that when you get there. Make sure to fill this bit in as well. Just 
Now, when you get to the top, it's slightly different. You're going to want to put a slab just on the top half of this top block that you've put down. And you're going to want to put some stairs there facing. That creates the lip on the front of the roof. And then you just want to slab across. Again, being careful not to mess up. There we go. Here, again, for symmetry's sake and all the rest of it, you want to put one there. And then down to finish this side of the roof. It's all pretty simple, this, you know, quite straightforward. And there we go. Now, I quite like it like that. You might want to double up these bits. If so, just stairs again. You just want to pop them in that corner between there, between the two blocks. And that gives it that look. Otherwise, you could keep it like this. Personal preference, entirely up to you. Now, at this point, it's probably a good idea to start thinking about safing it up if you are on survival so potentially put torches down put a fence around it and it's time to decorate so hopefully you've got a few bits i've got a bed Got a furnace and a crafting table that I can put in here. Obviously, if you've got paintings, you can put on the walls. You can put barrels in, or if they're for villagers, you can put down profession tables, things like you know uh, enchanting tables, things like that. Pop the bed in. Make sure you put the windows in. Those two glass panes. There we go. Maybe put some torches on the inside too. Now about the ceiling. I personally don't mind it looking like this. I think it looks cool. But if you're not into seeing the, uh, the roof or the underside of the roof, you just slab it off. Now if you are going to slab it off though, I'd just put these blocks again on the top half. It just gives you a nice little... He says, there we go. It gives you a nice little contrast between the two blocks. And now, obviously, you can start seeing where expansion comes from. If this house was a little bit bigger, you could have a, a ladder going up there and a, a loft room or potentially access to a, a second story. And obviously, all these blocks that I've used, you could use anything you want. But yeah, oh, and don't forget to put your door on. <laughs> I knew I'd forget something, I always do. But there we go. That's the most basic house design. I hope you've liked it. If so, like, comment, subscribe, and hopefully I'll see you for episode two. Thanks.